Summer Rebalance Highlight – Last Stand Up until now, Last Stand had no visual telegraphing whatsoever. You could never know whether or not the enemy has this module, so you always had to play like it is there. Just to be sure. That's especially true for higher leagues, where most commanders have it as a must-have pick. But now, starting from the next update, you can check opponent's durability bar and instantly get the info you need. See the extra tint in there. That's last stand. Bait it, get behind the cover, wait over, and then turn back and fight for real. Ares. Many asked us to nerf Ares. It is too strong, they said. It is everywhere, they said. And we've done some fine tuning to this robot for 5.3, not to kill it as a viable pick, but to make it more manageable. Ares now loses a third of its movement speed when Absorber is active. This should give you more breathing room if you are against one. Robots like Hellburner might get even more attractive when you face Ares trains. And also, in 5.3, Ares's ability cooldown will go slightly upwards. This is to make the new module phase shift less of a killer on this particular robot. On the test server, it made Ares almost invincible, and trust me, no one wants that to happen. Raven. Let's face it, Raven is great for doing some neat trick jumping, but when you want to use it for aggressive combat maneuvers, you're risking way too much for what you get. If you want to feel like a bird of prey, Falcon is generally a much safer choice, because it actually gets something for exposing itself to all winds. That's why in 5.3 we will give Raven a temporary damage buff that activates after you jump. You deal 20% more damage this way. This should give you a reason to use Raven's ability to leap in rather than bounce out.